Hello, welcome to the CEO DG and La YouTube channel. Current Affairs Mega Series MCQs 25 Question and Answers of 2020 Edition. This is highly useful for SSC, Railways, RBI, SPI. IBPS NABAD and all competitive exams First one ADB has approved how much loan for the Delhi Meerut Regional Rapid Transit system The options are A USD 1 billion B USD 2 billion C USD 3 billion D USD 1.5 billion Second one Which Arab nation will become the first one to launch a Mars probe on July 15th? The options are A UAE, B Saudi Arabia, C Qatar, D Bahrain. First one, ADB has approved how much loan for the Delhi Meerut Regional Rapid Transit System? The answer is option A USD 1 billion. Asian Development Bank ADB has approved a loan of 1 billion dollars to support the construction of the high speed modern Delhi Meerut regional rapid transit system the officials of NCR Transport Corporation entity executing the project confirmed the news on August 18th 2020 second one which arab nation will become the first one to launch a mars probe on july 15th the answer is option a uae the united arab emirates has decided to send a probe to mars in a first for the arab world the uae's mars probe aims to provide a comprehensive image of the weather dynamics in mars atmosphere and pave the way for scientific breakthroughs third one which nation has been promised to be given priority in india's covid-19 vaccine the options are a nepal b bhutan c maldives d bangladesh fourth one which nation is looking for collaboration with india to mass produce its covid vaccine the options are a china b us c russia d brazil third one which nation has been promised to be given priority in india's covid-19 vaccine the answer is option d bangladesh india's foreign secretary harshvardhan shringla said during the concluding day of the two day visit to bangladesh that the country will get priority in the covid-19 vaccine produced by india he stated that India is in an advanced stage of COVID-19 trial and it is going to produce vaccines at a massive level. Fourth one, which nation is looking for collaboration with India to mass produce its COVID-19 vaccine? The answer is option C, Russia. Russia has expressed confidence in India's ability to mass produce Sputnik 5 and is looking for collaboration. Russia has become the first country in the world to give regulatory approval to the COVID-19 vaccine. Fifth one, which city was ranked at the top in the Swachh Sarvekshan 2020 rankings list? The options are A Surat, B Navi Mumbai, C Bhopal, D Indore. Sixth one, which state will be the first one in India? to offer government jobs based on the cet score the options are a telangana b madhya pradesh c delhi d maharashtra fifth one which city was ranked at the top in the swachh sarvekshan 2020 rankings list the answer is option d indore the swachh sarvekshan 2020 results were announced on 
August 20, 2020 and Indore retained its top spot for the fourth consecutive time. Indore was adjudged as the cleanest Indian city followed by Surat on the second spot and Navi Mumbai on the third position. Sixth one, which state will be the first one in India to offer government jobs based on the CET score? The answer is option B, Madhya Pradesh. Madhya Pradesh is going to be the first state in India to offer government jobs based on score secured in the Common Eligibility Test, CET, which will be conducted by the proposed National Recruitment Agency. Seventh one, Indian Navy has pushed an urgent proposal to acquire how many ship-based drones? The options are A. 10, B. 21, C. 8, D. 19. Eighth one, which two nation warships engaged in mini collision in the eastern Mediterranean on August 12th. The options are A. Israel, Italy B. Greece, Turkey C. Egypt, Jordan D. Lebanon, Turkey Seventh one, Indian Navy has pushed an urgent proposal to acquire how many ship-based drones? The answer is Option A, 10. Indian Navy has pushed forward a proposal to urgently acquire 10 ship-borne drones that will help the force keep a close eye on the activities of the adversaries. Eighth one, which two nation warships engaged in mini-collision in the eastern Mediterranean on August 12th? The answer is option B, Greece and Turkey. A Greek and Turkish warship engaged in a mini collision on August 12th, 2020 during a standoff in the eastern Mediterranean. Turkey recently deployed survey ship Oris Rice to undertake seismic research for energy resources in the eastern Mediterranean Sea in an area that is claimed by both Turkey and Greece. Ninth one. When did Defence Minister Rajnath Singh launch Atmanirbhar Bharat Saptah? The options are A. August 9th B. August 10th C. August 8th D. August 4th 10th one Which month will be observed as Nutrition Month as per Prime Minister Narendra Modi? The options are A. October B. December C. September D. November Ninth one. When did Defence Minister Rajnath Singh launch Atmanirbhar Bharat Sapta? The answer is option B. August 10th. Defence Minister Rajnath Singh launched the Atmanirbhar Bharat Sapta on August 10th, 2020. The special week promotes Prime Minister Narendra Modi's vision to create a self-reliant India with an increased focus on local manufacturing and production. Tenth one, which month will be observed as Nutrition Month as per Prime Minister Narendra Modi? The answer is option C, September. Prime Minister Narendra Modi on August 30th, 2020 announced that September will be observed as Nutrition Month. He shared the information while talking about the importance of following a nutritious diet in his monthly Monkey Bath radio program. 11th one, which among the following parties won just one seat in Sri Lankan parliamentary elections 2020? The options are A. UNP, B. SLPP, C. JVP, D. SJB. 12th one, which institute has signed an agreement with Gavi, the vaccine alliance, to accelerate manufacture and delivery of 100 million doses of COVID vaccine? The options are a. Biocon B. ICMR C. SII D. Bharat Biotech 11th one Which among the following parties won just one seat in Sri Lankan parliamentary elections 2020? 
The answer is option A, UNP. Former Sri Lankan Prime Minister Ranil Vikramasinghe's United National Party, UNP, suffered the biggest setback in the Sri Lankan parliamentary elections 2020. The party managed to win only one seat. Twelfth one. Which institute has signed an agreement with Gavi, the vaccine alliance to accelerate manufacture and delivery of 100 million doses of COVID vaccine? The answer is option C, SII. The Serum Institute of India, SII, has entered into a landmark partnership with Gavi. The vaccine alliance and the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation to accelerate the manufacture and delivery of COVID vaccine for India and the middle and low income countries. 13th, which nation's president resigned after being detained at gunpoint by mutinying soldiers? The options are A. Belarus, B. Syria, C. Turkey, D. Mali. 14th, when was the 78th anniversary of Quit India Day observed. The options are A. August 6th B. August 7th C. August 8th D. August 9th 13th Which nation's president resigned after being detained at gunpoint by mutinying soldiers? The answer is Option D. Mali Mali President Ibrahim Bobakar Keita announced his resignation and dissolved the parliament on August 19, 2020, after he was reportedly detained at gunpoint by mutinying soldiers. 14th, when was the 78th anniversary of Quit India Day observed? The answer is option D, August 9th. President Ramnath Kovind honored and felicitated 202 freedom fighters from across the country on August 9, 2020, on the occasion of the 78th anniversary of Quit India Day. Every year, the President hosts an at-home reception at Rastrapati Bhavan on the anniversary of the Quit India Movement to honour freedom fighters. However, this year, the reception could not be organised due to the COVID-19 pandemic. 15th. Which country is ranked first in the number of organic farmers? The options are A. Sri Lanka B. Switzerland C. India D. Finland 16th. Which state or union territory will host the International Film Festival of India 2020? The options are A. Ladakh B. Goa C. Karnataka D. Assam 15th. Which country is ranked first in the number of organic farmers? The answer is Option C. India India has been ranked first in the number of organic farmers and ninth in terms of area under organic farming. Sikkim has become the first state in the world to become fully organic. Other states including Uttarakhand and Tripura have also set similar sustainability targets. Sixteenth, which state or union territory will host the International Film Festival of India 2020? The answer is option B, Goa. The International Film Festival of India, IFFI, will be held in November 2020 as per the schedule of the event. The event is usually held in Goa between November 20th to 28th. The same timeline has been fixed for the event this year as well. 17th Which state's chief minister has approved Rs 200 crore worth package for poor families affected by COVID-19? The options are a. Delhi B. Maharashtra C. Odisha D. Charkhan 18th Which Indian cricketer has been recommended for the Rajiv Gandhi Kail Ratna Award by the National Sports Awards Committee? The options are A. Shikhar Dhawan B. Jaspreet Bumrah C. Rohit Sharma D. K. L. Rahul 17th Which state's chief minister has approved Rupees 200 crore worth package for poor families affected by COVID-19. The answer is option C, Odisha. Odisha Chief Minister Naveen Patnaik approved a special assistance package 
worth rupees 200 crore on August 26, 2020 for the poor and extremely vulnerable families in the state which have been affected by COVID-19 pandemic. 18th, which Indian cricketer has been recommended for the Rajiv Gandhi Kail Ratna Award by the National Sports Awards Committee? The answer is option C, Rohit Sharma. The National Sports Awards Committee has recommended the names of cricketer Rohit Sharma, table tennis champion Manika Batra, Paralympian Mariyappan Tangavelu and wrestler Vinesh Pogat for the prestigious Rajiv Gandhi Kail Ratna Award. 19th, which nation has reopened select visa services for Indian students, researchers and teachers? The options are A. US, B. UK, C. Japan, D. France. 20th, which nation has banned transactions with TikTok owner ByteDance and WeChat's parent firm Tencent? The options are A. US, B. India, C. UK, D. Japan. 19th, which nation has reopened select visa services for Indian students researchers and teachers? The answer is option D, France. France has reopened select visa services for Indian students, researchers and teachers invited by an academic establishment or laboratory and holders of talent passport. 20th, which nation has banned transactions with TikTok owner ByteDance and WeChat's parent firm Tencent? The answer is option A, US. US President Trump has signed a new executive order that bans US transactions with TikTok owner by dance and WeChat parent firm Chinese tech giant Tencent. 21st, when will National Handloom Day be observed? The options are A. August 8th B. August 7th C. August 6th D. August 10th 22nd, when will PM Narendra Modi confer PM's Awards for Excellence in Public Administration. The options are A. August 31st B. October 2nd C. September 30th D. October 31st 21st When will National Handloom Day be observed? The answer is Option B. August 7th National Handloom will be celebrated on August 7th, 2020 to commemorate the Swadeshi movement which was launched on the same date in 1905. The main objective behind celebrating the day is to generate awareness about the handloom industry among the public. 22nd, when will PM Narendra Modi confer PM's awards for excellence in public administration? The answer is option D, October 31st. Prime Minister Narendra Modi will confer the Prime Minister's awards for excellence in public administration on Rastriya Ekta Divas, 31st October, at the Statue of Unity in Gujarat. The Prime Minister's awards have been comprehensively restructured this year to recognize the contribution of civil servants in the strengthening of service delivery and redressal of public grievances. 23rd, when was International Youth Day observed? The options are A. August 12th B. August 11th C. August 10th D. August 9th 24th Mount Sinabung erupted on August 10th, 2020 spewing columns of smoke and ash into the sky. The active volcano is located in which country? The options are A. The Philippines B. Thailand C. Malaysia D. Indonesia 23rd, when was International Youth Day observed? The answer is option A, August 12th. International Youth Day was observed on August 12th, 2020. The day aims to celebrate young people's voices, actions and initiatives as well as their meaningful, universal and equitable engagement. The day's theme this year is Youth Engagement for Global Action. 24th, Mount Sinabung erupted on August 10th, 2020, spewing columns of 
smoke and dash into the sky the active volcano is located in which country the answer is option d indonesia indonesia's mount sinabang erupted on august 10th 2020 spewing massive tower of smoke and dash into the sky plunging local communities and villages into darkness mount sinabang which was dormant volcano for almost 400 years rode back to life in 2010 25th which institute ranked first in the list of top innovative educational institutes in india the options are a iit delhi b iit madras c iit bombay d iit kanpur 25th which institute ranked first in the list of top innovative educational institutes in india the answer is option b iit madras the indian institute of technology madras has retained its top rank in the list of top innovative educational institutes in india for the second consecutive year the institute was ranked number 1 in the atal ranking of institutions on innovation achievements released by vice president venkai naidu in a virtual event on august 18th 2020 धन्यवाद थैंक यू इफ यू लाइक दिस वीडियो डू लाइक सब्सक्राइब एंड शेयर सी यू इन द नेक्स्ट वन बाय बाय